Greetings YouTube, I'm about to discuss some frank and graphic sexual material. So if this is the kind of thing that you don't like to listen to, or it makes you uncomfortable, or if you're under 18, I suggest you stop watching this video and move along. Um, can't make you do it, but I'm just giving you a fair warning. I just filmed and will be shortly posting a video that deals with the social conservative agenda that's out to strip the um, gay community of their civil rights and uh, and human rights. And one of the things I encounter when I'm discussing this topic on a regular basis, and I encountered it here on YouTube, I encountered, I encountered it on other forums, I've encountered it um, in the news, both video and print, um, I encounter this on a regular basis. So it seems to be pervasive, so, uh, pervasive among the socially conservative set, is their fascination with the mechanics of gay sex. They frequently will tell me, Don't you know that gay sex mean a man puts his penis into another man's rectum? Or, Don't you know that gay sex means a man, he, he, he puts a man's penis into his mouth? They have this fascination with the mechanics of sex between two men. They very rarely, if ever, mention lesbians. And I don't know if this is a good thing or insulting but it's a thing, they seem to be fixated in a very interesting way about the mechanics of gay sex. It also seems to be completely lost on them that heterosexual couples can and do in fact engage in oral sex, man on woman, woman on man, and that heterosexual couples will engage in anal intercourse, man on woman and woman on man, and the person is still a heterosexual. Ass play knows no gender, sex, or orientation boundaries. Um, and this never seems to occur to them. As though they live in this sexual bubble, this, this zone free of all contamination from the outside that they perceive as the negative, as they perceive as the aberrant. But of course, all the activities that they condemn um, the gay males to, to having having done are things that heterosexual couples do every single darn day. In fact, I would be stunned that some of them themselves have not at some point in the past engaged in those very activities. While, of course, condemning gay men for the same things. And again, they all seem to ignore the lesbians. I do not understand why, but they do. So, I'm trying to understand this. Now, I could be just be flippant and say that a lot of these conservative, uh, social conservatives are actually, you know, have, questioning their own sexuality and they're fixated about this because they are curious or they find it fascinating on a very personal level. But I, I think that would be shallow. Funny, but shallow. Um, there has to be a deeper reason. And I don't know what it is. So I'm trying to understand. Um, in fact, I have argued in the past, and I will argue here, that there are some social conservatives that think about sex between two men more than the men who are having the sex think about it. And that's fascinating and odd. So I, w I want people, can you tell me? Can you throw some knowledge in my direction? Can you, can you explain to me why some social conservatives find the sex between two men, or assuming multiple men, to be so interesting, so fascinating, something that they have to explain to the whole world in graphic detail, in every form of media they can grip with their little sweaty hands. Can someone enlighten me? <laughs>